Hi, it's Carl here for Pro-V TV, and this is the new Sony FS5, which introduced a couple of really interesting new features, which I thought were worth taking a closer look at. So in this video, we're going to have a closer little look at Sony's new clear image zoom function. Now, digital zooming is normally completely ruled out for any kind of professional video work because it just enlarges the image and to be honest, it ruins the quality. It's essentially the same thing as taking your image in post and just scaling it up, which we all know doesn't look great. But Sony are claiming that this clear image zoom, although at its core it is still a digital zoom, is able to perform a 1.5 times zoom in 4K and a two times zoom in 1080p without noticing any drop in quality. And from the quick tests that I've done, that does seem to be the case, which is pretty amazing really. Now I was using this clear zoom every now and again while I was out and about shooting and then later on at home when I looked at the footage on my computer I couldn't pick out which shots I'd used it on and which ones I hadn't which I was really quite impressed by. The way it works is a bit science fiction-y and I'm not going to claim to understand it fully because I definitely definitely don't but from what I understand the camera has a database inside it which can tell what you were shooting so that the camera can intelligently add extra detail to the image when you zoom in. It knows what should be sharp and it knows what should be soft. For example, in my test shot, I was filming a plant. Now the camera uses its database to know that it's a plant that I'm filming. And when I zoom in with the clear image zoom, it knows that the leaves are leaves and that the pot is a pot. And so it only adds detail where it should be. Now I know that sounds crazy and it's like a cool technology demo or some kind of gimmick or something like that, but it really does seem to work quite well. It's hard to see if there's a drop in quality in shots like this, but it definitely does seem usable to me when it is zoomed in fully. I'm sure there's a slight drop in quality, but I can't really notice it. You'll have to make that decision for yourself as to whether you trust it to give you good results. All I can say is that personally, I don't think I'd think twice before using it on a professional job. I mean, this has the potential to be such a useful tool, especially if you like shooting with prime lenses or wide angle zooms, as you'll just be able to get that little bit of extra reach if you ever need it. It's great to see Sony pushing the boundaries and giving us new features which actually make your life as a shooter easier. Now as always, if you have any questions, please leave a comment below, I'll try my best to get back to you, or just give one of our team here in the office a call or visit our website and we'll see if we can give you a hand. Thanks for watching.